Okay, YouTube is Tuesday, 9.36 a.m. Day 16 on this truck. And got the doors back on, of course. Y'all seen it. Got everything um, lined up on the inside that I can see. Um, still waiting on some stuff to get here today. The steering wheel adapter and strikers and stuff like that. But today... It's just going to be another day of just nothing but body work. Um, man, I told y'all when I put this primer on, I seen so much stuff that's wrong. And I know I can't make this old truck perfect because, I mean, it was just an old beat up truck. But I got to at least make it presentable for me to drive. So, as you can see, we done, we've done all this up in here. Still messing with this again. It's still low. And been messing with this hood some more. I had to create some more problems for myself. I kept sanding, kept sanding, and got it all the way down to where the line was back again. And it makes the thing, it'll make it come up if the line, if you don't have it covered up. You're going to have some kind of hump regardless because, I mean, it's a fiberglass on a hood, on a uh, steel hood. Okay, I kept noticing uh, something here that from an angle, it just looked like it was pushed in. Okay, now back here, what we had was, um, I had to beat it down some because it was, for some reason, I mean, it was a lot of, it was high in a lot of little spots, just everywhere I sand, it was just high. So I had to beat it in a little bit, knock it down, try to get it smooth. And that's why you see the filler all the way down through there because I had to go all the way down through there because it was, like I said, it was just kind of, and these were just little dings at the bottom of the door. And it's going to still, it's going to probably be a few more, probably. Um, and this one, through here, through here, through here. Um, down here with some more. And then you come back here. We had a lot, it's a lot going on right here. Because everything that was hit somewhere right here because ain't nothing lighting up right there. But I mean, I ain't tripping on that because the truck been here for a lot of years. So. so I got all these little spots I'm trying to fix today. So it's going to be a long day. As y'all can see, it go all the way down. I just kept, every time I look, I just find more spots, more spots. But, hey, that's part of it. Just to make it look decent anyway. Like I said, it's not going to be perfect, so I don't want nobody to think that, hey, this going to be a, this body going to be, hey, like a brand new truck because it ain't. But hopefully it'll be presentable. And I'm doing this again. Right here, still had a little wave in it. Um, this door, this door, man, this door just messed up anyway, but I do got to open and close it. So I'm not going to do a whole lot right there. I'm going to probably just end up, if I do decide to keep the truck, I'll probably end up just getting another door later on and probably another bed too. Uh, that's what it comes down to. Just depends. Okay, then I found another, it was a dent right here in the front, so I didn't see that. Um, but we got it now, we're going to try to get it fixed. So we just got a lot of, we weren't nowhere near where I thought I was, so. But, that's about all it's going to get. I mean, hey. I got stuff already waiting on me. I'm, I'm, I need to go ahead and try to get started on some of this stuff that's sitting here. But I'm going to go ahead and try to knock this out today. Get everything back smooth. And then go ahead and get it ready to spray. And hey. Hey, I can't. Ain't nothing I can do about it. It is what it is. It's just an old beat up truck. We just want to make it look real presentable. Don't get it twisted. It look, hey, is 
I could pull out right now and it's way 10 times better than what it was. But I'm saying for me to paint on top of something, I want it to be something worth me painting on top of is what I'm trying to say. Because I could just put the in primer and just drive it. And hey, it'll be in primer. But for me to paint on it and spend the money on the paint and the clear, man, I need it to be presentable. So that's the dilemma I'm in with this old truck. And everybody keep in mind, please keep in mind what this truck looked like. And this this on day 16. And what all we done done in 16 days on this truck. Keep that in mind. Please keep that in mind. We talking about up under the bed, up under the frame, up under the truck, interior totally different, hood, um, just everything, man. It's a, it's a lot that took place on this old truck, believe it or not. So that's why I'm trying to make the body, you know, pretty, pretty good. So, so all this work won't be put in all this work and then the outside look kind of trashy. So that's, that's not good. But anyway, this is where we at today. And I'll hit y'all back later on when I get some of this stuff fixed. <clears throat> okay, YouTube, it's still Tuesday. It's 4 o'clock, 6 to 8 degrees, temperature dropping in here. <clears throat> I've been messing with this truck all day. And I'm tired of messing with it, so it is what it is. I quit right here. I'm going to just uh, hey, let the chips fall where they fall. I got other stuff I need to be trying to get done. So let's see what we got so far. We got the prime, uh, the white on. Again, got a bug. Got a bug in it right there. It's still not dry. It's just, uh, just got through spraying a little while ago, so. I'm going to give it, <clears throat> by it being as cold as it is, I'm going to just wait till tomorrow before I start cleaning it because I put some extra on this hood. So, but y'all can see the hood now. Like I said, um, this truck is not perfect at all but especially right up in here I don't I probably just end up getting another door at some point this bed right here then it ain't as bad <clears throat> considering it was you know it was messed up right here and puffed out right here and I call myself getting a line back on it so it ain't perfect but hey I wasn't trying to make it perfect because I can't not in those 16 this is just 16 days so we know I can't do it in 16 days but I am pretty I think it came a long ways in 16 days considering where it was and tomorrow I go ahead and uh, clear it up because I, I got the doors closed in here <clears throat> I sprayed it with the doors open. But I just went ahead. This, the temperature's starting to drop now. Because you know the time and change here. So it's getting dark about 5. About 10 after 5 is already dark. So I might cut some heat on in here too. Um, to just go ahead. and, But it'll be dry enough in a little while. It's almost getting there. But I'm still going to let it, I'm gonna let it set to tomorrow. Because I don't need... I'm kind of tired in a way. So I'm going to just take this time to give me a little rest. And I got something to do in the morning. So I come back <clears throat> and spray it. And I did get the um, the strikers did come in. And the um, steering wheel adapter did come in too. So we got everything here for it that we need. The only thing I got to do uh, once I get through with everything is make the console. 
And I don't know if I'm going to be in a hurry to do that. I might wait because, like I said, I got, man, I got several, several cars I got to do. I mean, it's a, I got a truck I got to start. I got a Cadillac I got to do for this guy. I mean, I just got too much stuff. That's how come I, I really can't just take the time on my own stuff like this because, man, people, man, people be just study coming and study coming. Don't get it. Uh, that's a good thing, though. I mean, it ain't no bad thing at all. It's a good thing that people trust me to do their stuff, even though I'm not a professional, not at all. But so I got to get this out the way and go ahead and get started on this other stuff before I um, get too far behind because it's getting it's going to start getting real cold real soon. So but tell me, you know, I kind of like the truck. I mean. Like I said, it ain't, it's not perfect, but I like where it's at uh, compared to what it was. And tomorrow, once I get that clear on this bad boy, she should be looking real good. Really, really good. I might go ahead and uh, I'm trying to debate. Um, I might just go ahead and clear it right here. I mean, I might. Cause I can, um, I might just do that. Cause I don't feel like trying to jack it up, put the wheels on, do all that, move it over there. So I might just, as cool as it's being, I might just go ahead and just clear it right here. So that way, the way I got it separated, <clears throat> I can uh, get a fan in here to help blow this stuff towards that big fan. And I can do the front part by itself. And the way the bed is separate, I can do the bed last by itself. So either way it go, I think I can salvage it to make it be all right without going over there. I mean, it's just going, like I said, it ain't like it's no, nobody else's, no customer's vehicle or nothing like that. So it ain't nothing like, it's just something I'm doing for myself, play around with. Cause I, I doubt if I can sell it anyway. So, but that's what we got so far. All right, we'll holler back. Okay, y'all, it's Wednesday, 12 o'clock. I'm rushing, cause I got, a, I got my little grandbaby there, so I'm babysitting. So I come out here to um, try to clear this truck right quick so I can get back in the house. And I cleared the truck. The paint job turned out great. Good looking paint job. But the truck still looked terrible. Um, the bed still ain't right. Um, which I can't get it right. It'll take me forever. I ain't got the time. But the hood and everything, the hood that I put on, man, it turned out. Man, it, it looks really good. So, um, everything, all the, the fenders, the front fenders and everything look real smooth and good. It's just that bed was so beat up in this door right here. So maybe one day, um, if I can find this stuff, i will replace the, the door right here. And i just probably replace the whole bed and just repaint it again. It ain't no big deal. If I can 
they were buying one. It's so hard to find a short, a short anything for these short wheelbase trucks. So, and I know it's kind of loud in here because I got all these fans going because I painted right here in this shop. But let me see. But y'all can you can see the flaw that's on this thing. This is probably even though the truck looked better than it did, this is probably the worst things I done done, to be honest with you. But I knew what I started with, and I knew the time that I had to do it. So I'm gonna just make it work for right now. And like I said, maybe if I can get a get another door on the driver's side and another bed later on, I just uh, fix it. But for right now, that's what I got. Can't stay long. Got to get back in the house. Um, I come back out here later on when she leave tonight probably and try to start putting stuff back on. So we'll holler back. Okay, YouTube, it's Thursday, 4, 08, 64 degrees in here. Um, we on day 18 of this, um, of this truck. Let me see. And um, I've been out here trying to put everything back on it and trying to put everything together. Which I still got some, I still got some stuff to do. But I do got the wheels on and back on the ground. As y'all can see, I got the, got the new side lights in. And got the new tail lights in. As y'all can see. Still got to put the bump on. Probably can't do that bumper by myself. That thing is really, really heavy, man. And, man, I still got to ride this light for a minute because, man, I opened up the box. I knew I got the light, but I opened up the box, man, and it's not the same light, man. So, man, I done really got messed up a lot this time on ordering stuff man but anyway I ain't got time to think about it right now but we do got the grill in got everything back on and that's how she's shaping up except for that ugly busted light so it ain't like I'm it's finna go nowhere no way I'm just I just need to get it out the way so I can get to work on some other stuff so I just probably move it over to the other building and let it sit there until I can get back on it But yep, this is what it is. And like I said, I started out, I wanted to make it look better than what it did and make it look presentable. And it's all right. It's all right. The paint job is 
and you can't even see the paint job for real in this phone, but it's got, man, it's got a lot of um, silver and gold pearl in it. But, like I said, man, this body is just, just not up to par. But, maybe if I keep it long enough, I can get some new stuff. But I'm on, I will drive it down like it is. Because it, it look a whole lot different than what we started out 18 days ago. Oh, I got some of the stuff in the, on the inside. I still ain't started no console. I probably won't even start that. It'll be, I ain't got time for that right now. Oh, man, a door lock. Hold on. Let me go around the other side and unlock the door. Well, y'all can see from this side. I do got uh, everything. Got the steering wheel in. I had to rig up something for right now because they didn't send me no centerpiece. And plus, uh, the adapter I got, man, I still had to rig up something. So, that seemed to be the start of my life, rigging something up. But, I still got to get this carpet right. I need to vacuum it out because it's super dirty now. But as you can see, the inside is, man, way. Now, I'm, I'm more impressed with the inside, to be honest with you, because, man, the inside was, well, the outside was terrible, but the inside was double terrible. Let me see if I can get over here and unlock this door. Oh, man, hold on. Too old for all this. Okay, now see this is what I like the way the dash and everything and I still got a I still got some pieces to put on I got to put this piece up under here turn around I got to put that piece on right there but it's painted everything I just haven't got to it yet so and I still got to put this on but as you can see man stuff look a it look a whole lot better I mean much, much better than, than it did. And it still got a long ways to go, but it's better. And how you like the sound just to be able to just shut the door, man. That's a beautiful thing. Cause this car, this truck to set up here for so long with the doors wouldn't even shut. Let me show you again. Look at that. Man. Boy, that within itself is, is a whole lot better. But all right, this is what we got. Like I said, I probably gonna pull it over here in the other building and let it sit for a little while. And I'll probably get back on it and finish up the interior with the console and everything. Probably when I get some more free time, which I don't know when that's gonna be. So, but we set out for 30 days. We got this much done in 18 days and uh, I just ain't got 30 days, man. I got, man, I got two or three cars, just people just waiting. So I got to get to work. So we'll holler back. That's what we got.